your Chinese music lesson, your first Chinese music lesson, and the Chinese music lesson only has one Chinese word, because that's the only one I know, and that is Lo. That is the symbol for Lo. And we're going to use that to learn Lo C. Si. Lo C. Si. This is the staff. That's the right hand, that's the left hand, and that is the low C in the second space up. And you know already that spaces are notes and lines are notes. So that's C, D, E, F, G, A, B, and C would be in the middle. This is the piece of music that we're going to learn. The piece of music is called E, E, F, F. E, E, D, D, C, and that refers to the right hand notes, which begin with E, E, F, F, E, E, D, D, middle C, middle C, middle, middle, middle C. The left hand begins on low, see this Chinese there, Cha, Chinese for low, low C, which is this note. And the bass is very familiar because it's a pattern like you already know. Then it moves one note up. Then it goes back to the same pattern at the beginning. drops one note down, one note below C to B. See it? And it ends with a chord. Now here's the whole piece. interesting about this that I want to point out. First is I made a mistake when I put these staves in because I didn't leave enough space between this one and that one so it doesn't look good. You see there's that space, that space, that, and then here is too small. And then down here I made a mistake. Instead of doing B G I did C G and it was wrong. So I cut out a little piece of paper and I pasted it over the section where I made a mistake and I wrote the names in the, the notes incorrectly. Now I'm going to play it one more time. changes, but only one finger changes at a time. The first is this, and the change goes to the thumb going up. Then it goes back to the original pattern. Then it goes to the little finger going down. And that ends like that. So only one finger changes at a time. And that is your Chinese lesson for this week.